want to show you how to set up your Samsung Pay because you can add your credit card right to your watch and you can pay right from your watch. So holding down on this bottom button here, simply hold down for one second. That's going to launch your Samsung wallet. You're going to hit the arrow and this is going to first install it. And then it's going to kick you right back over to the phone where you'll need to set up Samsung Pay on your phone first. Once you set it up on the phone, then you can sync specific credit cards with your watch and you'll be able to pay with your watch. So we're going to hit install. Once installed, we're going to hit open. We're going to hit verify and you'll want to set a pin for your wallet. You're going to have to enter this pin every single time you try to pay with your watch. All right. So now my pin is in. I'm next going to need to scan my fingerprint. Hit continue. Now, in order to use Samsung Pay, you will need to set up a watch screen lock, which is going to be a code that you will enter on your watch. Um, so it's going to lock your watch and make it more secure. We're going to hit settings. You'll decide if you want it to be a, a, a pin code or a pattern. I'm going to make mine a pin code. We're going to check the box here. Tap on set pin and then you're set a four digit pin for your watch. It will make you enter it twice. Make sure it's something that you can remember, obviously. And if you look at the phone here, we're all done. We're going to hit done. And now, so again, I've already had uh, my account is already set up, so it may ask you to do a few more things first, but you'll want to go to payment cards. Now I already have a credit card that is synced again to my account. So all I need to do is hit activate to add the card and then I'll be good to go. Now, just so you can see, this is what the pin screen looks like. And I have to enter this pin code first before I can do any more uh, changes on the phone that will show on the watch. So tapping the screen here and you'll see the little lock at the top here and I'm going to enter that pin code. Okay. So my pin code is in. Now I can jump back over and I can activate this credit card. And then you'll need to have your card handy so you can enter the expiration, the security code and your zip code. Now, there was one small hiccup when I tried to do this. For some reason, it said that the credit card company declined the request to be able to add the credit card to my wallet. So here is the backup way if that happens to you. So on your Samsung phone, you're going to swipe up to get to Samsung Pay and you'll hit the plus in the upper right corner to add a, a new card to your wallet. So I'm going to hit payment cards and then add a credit card. Now you can add the card by scanning it or you can hit add card manually and then you can enter the credit card number, the card name. And let's do all that right now. OK, so I added all the information in. I'm going to agree to the terms and then we'll go back and try again to add the credit card. We do need to have it send a text message to verify the information. It's blurred out for security purposes, so if you see any blurriness on the screen, that's why. OK, so we've successfully added a new card to our Samsung wallet. Now it's going to ask you automatically if you want to add that card to your watch. So this is even better. So we're going to hit set. Hit replace as our default card. Tap add to watch. We're going to agree to the terms again. We have to verify the card again. And there we go. Our card is officially added to our wallet. So now we do need to do a quick update. So we'll update the wallet. Lots of steps, you know, for the sake of security and running the latest software. So it's a little tedious, but I wanted to make sure to walk through all these steps with you so that you can successfully add a card to your watch as well. You should be able to use your watch at any terminal that uses NFC. A lot of the terminals in the US are being converted so that you can do wireless payments. So if it accepts um, just tap uh, payments and you should be able to pay with your watch. Let's switch back over to the watch. Now we will have to put our pin code in. OK, now let's hold down on that bottom button to launch our Samsung pay and we'll enter our pin. And now our credit card is showing up, which is perfect. And now we just simply you take your watch and you hold it right next to the reader and it will be able to pick up uh, your credit card signal and allow you to pay. So 
Anyway, that is the process to set up and use Samsung Pay. And this takes us to the end of our video.